Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to End Right for your PE day. Um, we're doing conditioning to end off your day. We're doing three exercises. We're doing scissor hops, uh, burpees, and toe taps. We're gonna be doing 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off of each of these. And I'm excited to get started with this. So I'm gonna get my timer started for our first one, which is scissor hops, okay? So I'm gonna move my ball off to the side here. Here we go, timer starting, ready, Go. So you're just finding a line on the floor and it's just movement back and forth. You're gonna go as quickly as you possibly can for 30 seconds. Time. Okay, so while you guys are resting, we're gonna take 30 seconds to rest. Um, make sure your opposite arm, opposite leg. I joke a lot with the students that sometimes they act like they're preparing for the zombie apocalypse and doing same arm, same leg. Make sure that when you do it, you do an opposite arm, opposite leg, okay? Whew. Whew. We got about 10 seconds left, and we're gonna dive into this next round. We're gonna do this five times, and we'll move to our next exercise. Okay, ready, and go. About five more seconds. And time. Great work, guys. We're two down. We've got three more to go. You want to stay light on your feet. Stay on the balls of your feet as you're moving. Right? I'm not flat-footed, but just on the balls of my feet. Very similar kind of a cadence to if you're jump roping. Okay, 10 more seconds, and we'll dive back into it. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one, and go. About 10 more seconds. And time. I went a few seconds over on that one. Sorry guys. We'll get about 20 seconds to rest and then we'll jump back into it. Ten more seconds. Here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Here we go. I'm on my balls and my feet, really pumping those arms. Drive my elbows behind me on the balls of my feet. Five more seconds. And time. Great job, guys. We just got one more, and we'll move into burpees. We're gonna do medicine ball burpees, just so you guys know. I'm using a ball here, I'm using a medicine ball, but you don't need a medicine ball if you're gonna do this. You can use a basketball or any household ball that you have and that will work great. Here we go, we got about five seconds left. Two, one, and go, here we go. Last one, let's make it your very best. Now that you're getting the coordination down, try to add as much speed to it as you possibly can. And time. Great job, guys. We'll take 30 seconds to rest and we'll transition into 
uh, burpees. So when we do this burpee, you're gonna come down into a push-up position, just hands on the ball, and then you'll jump up and push the ball up to the ceiling, and then back down again into the push-up position. I'm not gonna worry about doing the actual push-up today, just going down into the position, back onto your feet, and jump in the air, okay? All right, that's time. I'll go ahead and get my timer set. Now to get started with our burpees. Here we go, guys. You ready? Let's get started. Ready, go. Down to the push-up, jump up. Push up and jump. You're doing great, guys. Almost there, about five seconds left. And time. Good work. One down, four more to go. About 10 seconds left. Okay, here we go, three, two, one, here we go. About 10 seconds left, you're doing great guys. And time. Nice job, 30 seconds to breathe. Okay, here we go, starting in three, two, one. Here we go. You guys are doing great. I know this is tough. Just give it your best effort. Take it at your pace. The reason why we train for time is because you just do it at your pace in the time that's given you. And time. Great job, guys. We're doing great. We're almost there. About 15 seconds left. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one, here we go. Halfway there, guys. and rest. Great job. We only got one more and we're done. Then we'll move to our last one, which is toe taps. You'll use a ball, the same ball that you're using for this one. You can continue to use it for this next drill. About 10 seconds left. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one, it's your last one. Let's make it count. Everything you got. Ten seconds left.
and time. Great job, guys. Let's take 30 seconds, catch your breath, and we'll move into the last one, which is toe taps. You're doing great. About 10 more seconds, and we'll get started. Toe taps is just tapping the ball each time. Okay? All right, that's time. Right. I'll reset my timer. Five minutes, here we go. Toe taps. Ready, set, and go. Timer's starting. Okay? You guys, you'll notice that I'm not actually touching the ball. It allows me to go a little faster. I could go faster if I'd like, okay? About five more seconds. And it's time. Good work, guys. Again, remember opposite arm, opposite leg. I see a lot of people when they first start doing this, they start lifting the same arm and the same leg. You wanna make sure that we're, we're training our mind to move opposite arm, opposite leg. That does a lot for better core stability. When you have two opposite levers twisting one way because the arm movement, as opposed to how the hip's moving, it's important that that core stays stable. Okay, here we go, ready. Here we go again, ready, go. You can go faster, add some speed to it. Got about 10 more seconds. Here we go, guys. You're doing great. We're almost there, five seconds. Time. I swear, guys. Again, you'll notice I'm not actually touching the ball. If I jump and touch, it slows me down. For the purpose of this drill, this is high intensity interval training, which is meant to get your heart rate up. So if we can add things to make more speed, I'm all about that. Okay, here we go. Five seconds left and we're going again. Okay, here we go. Ready, go. About 10 seconds left, guys, you're doing great. Five more seconds. And time. Nice job. We're down to our last two minutes and we're done for the day. You guys are doing great. It's a great way to finish the day. Getting your heart rate up. Improve your, cardio, improve your cardiovascular strength. We got 10 seconds left. Here we go. All right, here we go. And go. As soon as you get the coordination down, add some speed. Show me what you got. Halfway there. About five seconds left. And time. Good. Guys, we only got one more and we're done for the day. Great work. All right, here we go. And go. As soon as you get the coordination down, add some speed. Show me what you got. Halfway there. About five seconds left. And time. Good. 
and we're done for the day. Great work.